Hello friends and fam, and welcome back to, this is not Paper Mario, Pokemon Shield! <laughs> Where we ended last episode mid-battle, because I wasn't paying attention to the timing. Uh, so I will do better about that today, but I finished off those Team Yell Grunts I saved uh, right after this gentleman gave me the bike. So we've got the bike to get across this long, long bridge. I'll read the manual. Press the plus button or minus button to ride your bike with Rotom. Let's get upcycling. I don't think he said upcycling. I think he just said let's get cycling. There are all these feathers. I literally never use those. So. What's the problem with those Team Yell goons? I can understand wanting to cheer someone on, but they cause so much trouble in the process. Hardly a decent way for fans to behave. Marnie's sentiments exactly. Yeah, I think there's only feathers all the way across this thing. That big bu building you see in the distance is Hammerlock Stadium. You're going to battle there, too. Oh, hi, Hob. There you are, Lexiac. I'm warning you, though. Any closer than that, we're going to have a battle, you and me. Okay, how's my team? I think my team is all messed up. Okay, let's go heal up. There's no one to heal me. Whatever, Hop, let's go. I warned you, we're both gym challengers who've earned ourselves a grass badge. This is the perfect training. Yeah, well... I don't remember if it's Wooloo or Hearth, but I think they're particularly... Let's have a taste of what a gym badge holder can do. I think they're, because of their fluff, their, like, physical defense is up. But, they're particularly susceptible to fire, even though it's not typically super effective against them because they're just normal type. Um... So it might be good to start leading my team with Forky Boy when I'm gonna battle against Top. Experience. Drago got a level up, two level ups, I think, to 13. Corpus Squire is that flying. We know him. We know that boy. It's this guy. Just flying, so we want electric. Uh, Drago's not very strong yet, though. I don't know. We can try to get a Nuzlocke on him, though. Yeah. If he takes too much damage, we'll swap him out. Hopefully it won't be a one-hit KO. <laughs> but look at this little sweet. He's got his little baby diaper on. Um, I don't know if you guys have realized by now, but I super love babies. <laughs> oh, yeah. Great. Beautiful. Uh, Quinn's snack today is Ritz crackers. My snack today is a whole lot of stuff jammed into a bowl together. Ugh, of course it's super effective and it does like nothing. But he's paralyzed. That is good for me. So. But all my attacks are physical. Well, acid is. So. Oh, yikes. Here's my thought process. Acid has twice the power. And it has a chance. No. Yeah, so it has twice the power. So they're pretty much equal because they're both his typing. They both get the same type as me advantage. And Nuzzle would be double against him, which would make them the same power level. <gasps> Yikes. That was my bad. I'm probably gonna w waste a move and, um, let's throw out my chitter and revive him because I do want him to level up. I want him to be one of my, my leads. Because I want a level 100 Toxel. He's paralyzed. I'm not worried about it. So, I, I should have paid more attention. 
That's my bad. Ha! Mmm. You're in for it now, buddy. Hey, don't pluck me back. I'll pluck you. I'm faster and you're paralyzed. Yeah, Gwen's clapping for me. See, Drago got two levels up from that. It would have been really awful if he hadn't uh, been revived. And Flossie got a level up, which is great. Grizzle. No, let's just keep him out. And, and like, my entire team other than Borky Boy could take this guy out. Every one of my Pokemon is an ace. Don't think this is over just yet. I don't know if that's what he said. I'm tossing Quinrit's crackers to keep him calm. Uh, yeah, because Pluck is gonna be great. Yep. <laughs> so, that didn't do as much as I thought it would. Honestly. Okay, we can take one more hit, I think. Fifteen. No, just keep plucking. It's it's fine. It's still my best bet. Okay, so I really have to decide now if I think we're gonna knock him out, and I do. I do think we're gonna knock him out. Ah. Uh. Okay, so I need to either heal up or swap out. Yeah, let's let Flossie out. Let's let Flossie have her own. Are you just breaking your ch your wrists? Your crackers? I have a feeling it's not gonna do much, pal. Well, he's got a few levels on me, so. I should have used Sing, and I will next turn. Because this is gonna be slow going. If he's asleep. Ooh. No, I don't have time for it. Because he's going to get a hit in. So I have to survive this and bind. And I'm not going to survive either. Dang. Pop is doing damage. I didn't want to use Thumper. But we're going to have to. Thumpy, take him out. Come on, Thumpity Thump. Thumpity Thump Thump Thump. Oh no, he's faster than me, even though I'm like three levels higher. No! Well, now I'm just very sad. Like, okay, I get it. Like, I was pretty beat up, but geez, you don't have to do this much damage. So now this is going to be twice as strong because he hit me first. Because he's so dang fast. Ha, thanks. Just have to survive this hit. Dad, <laughs> um, we might have a problem. <laughs> okay, let's see. What's our speed? 50. Uh, so he is my fastest. Let's see if he can get a hit in. That's the most likely chance I've got. Is if we can get in with a hit before he gets us. Okay. 
And Zombro is only 45, so he's got to be like 40, between 46 and 49. It's a very small range. But everyone who is still alive got a level up. Chitter, Borky Boy, wants to learn agility? I don't think so, sweet baby. This raises his speed. Okay, we'll take speed. We both got ourselves the same grass badge, so how come you're so much stronger? I don't know, man. You really messed me up with only three Pokemon. You did a number on my team. You've gotten strong, Lexiac. Seems like I've got to train even harder from now on. Granted, most of my team was at half health or lower. Next up is Nessa, the leader of the water gym. Thanks for screwing up my team and then not healing me. I don't think he healed me. Nope. Here's one revive. That's okay. I've gotten soft if I think that the game needs to heal me every every battle. I remember having to go back to the last town to heal up. Because you lost the battle because you didn't want to go back to the last town to heal up. Yeah, they're all feathers. An item for use on a Pokemon. And they slightly increase... Nope, not doing it. Not till we get healed. We're gonna come back and battle them after I heal, though. Because uh, we're not ready. We're not ready for more battles. Not at partial health. Holbury! Mm hmm. Cufant is a cute elephant. And Copperaja is whatever Copperaja is supposed to stand for. Like, copper. Um. <clears throat> oh, what's that? That one, the elephant with the forearms and the missing tusk. What's his name? He's a guide. He broke his tusk off to uh, write the thousand verses of something. Oh, I don't remember. Oh well. Yeah, I know. We can see a rare Pokemon at Wedgers. It's gonna kill me. I have no idea. Have you seen the sights in Holbury? No. Okay, let's battle you. Get the ball. Work to raise the good points of a Pokemon. Don't, don't worry about its bad points. Uh oh. If you use pluck against a cherubi, you should just get to eat the whole thing. Because it is a berry. Look at it. Like, just look at it. It's a berry. Its dex entry says something about, um the size of the second head being important for to decide on the flavor. Mm -hmm. Wubat? Um, yeah, it's flying. Let's give Drago a turn. There's a cracker. Yummy! Mm -hmm. I should have named him Daddy. Daddy the Daddy. Daddy the Daddy. 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 Yeah, die, die, die. Uh-oh. And I'm just paralyzed. Yeah. Okay. I'll take it. We'll swap out. <laughs> Why is Dark... Is Wubat part psychic? Go. Interesting. I just thought it was just normal. Interesting. Bop. Thanks. Are you not eating your crackers? Bop. 
Papa. No? Well, what can I do for you? I'll accept that I lost, but I'm not going to let it bother me that much. Okay, that's fine. Accept that you lost. Don't let it bother you that much. That sounds like a good thing. Special attack. An item that sharply boosts the special attack out of a Pokemon during battle. It wears off once the Pokemon is withdrawn. I never use those. I, I assume that they're good for... Oh, that's Minchino. I assume that they're good for competitive battles, but I keep this to yourself, but I'm having Pokemon help with my work. Yikes. Free labor. You're challenged by office worker Gabriel. Ga Gabrielle? Gab Ga Gabriel. Ga Gabrielle. Because <laughs> Gabriel is without the extra L-E at the end. And then there's Gabriella, which is the same name with an A instead of an E. Gotcha. Names are hard. I need to stop using assurance. I need to move it to the bottom. Not very effective. Pawn is That's good. I only wanted to use physical uh, attack moves anyway. Um, let's slash him. Oh, are you sleepy? Is it nap time? Well, you stay right here. How do we do? Drago grew to level 17. Sorry, I had to walk away for a second. Mm. Office worker Gabrielle. You're a trainer who's stronger than me and the Pokemon that can do my work. She's all sad and whispering into her cell phone. Like the whispering woods. Pokemon that appear to be surrounded by a brilliant aura tend to be stronger. When you defeat them, they drop what? Seems you're more likely to see them, blah 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 blah. Okay. Oh, I never noticed the geoglyph is actually on the map there. Oh. Hey, President Snow. Our sincerest apologies. The chairman is quite busy at the moment. Everyone, please disperse. Please leave now. Okay, see you later, Chairman. No need to rush off. I can still do more autographs. I'll even give you my Pokemon League card. <sighs> he looks like such a dad. He's got such a dad bod. We need the support of our fans to keep doing what we're doing. Chasing them off like that. Aren't you being a, too, a bit too harsh, Oleana? Fans are very important, of course. That's why you need to keep doing your work. For their sake. I promise to do everything in my power to assist you, too, Chairman. I forget the voice that I give people, so they get a new one every... Oh, and you were... Bead, sir. That's right, Bead. I dare say I'm impressed how far you've come since I gave you that Pokemon all those years ago. Will you be the one to win the gym challenge? Or perhaps it'll be one of the trainers endorsed by the champion. I will prove your faith in me was well-placed, Chairman. I won't lose to anyone. Anyway, I'll be on my way now. Yeah, in my head, he's just like Gary, but more of a little snot. Oh, your name was Lexiak, right? We were just talking about you. I admit, I'm curious about Leon's reasons for endorsing you. Ah, oh, I just had a good idea, as I tend to do. You're going to face gym leader Nessa soon, yes? If you get a gym badge from her, I'll hold a celebration. I'd like to get to know you a little better, after all. Chairman, we should really be going. Please, do your best for the sake of Galar's future. The chairman will be heading to this town's seafood restaurant. Win the gym badge and join him there at once. Do not keep him waiting. Oh, I'll keep him waiting. Okay, so... Do, do, do. Hello, friend. Why is Dynamax possible only in Galar? Even Professor Magnolia doesn't know why. Because that's where the power spots are. It's no exaggeration to say that Chairman Rose developed Galar as it is today. What about... Oh, what about you? I get excited to see the Pokemon that everyone checks in with the nurse. Oh, that's cute. Okay, bye. I also wonder if you choose a one of the preset male body types for your avatar if there are if the things that you get are different.
Oh. Okay, well, um, there's a little bit of stuff to do. I'm not going to go into all the houses just yet, because that's something that I just want to do later. The train station. Clickety clack. Clickety clack. There's a train on the tracks. We've got this, um, CD that was gifted to us by one of Alex's family members. And Quinn loves it, so we listen to it a lot. Uh, sometimes it's the only thing that keeps him calm in the car. So I know all those songs pretty well. You must be a gym challenger, right? If you're looking for the gym leader, Nessa, she's off at the lighthouse. The lighthouse is, well, if you head towards the sea from here, you shouldn't be able to miss it. Oh, you see that Wingle? I hope you saw that Wingle that was right at the top of the screen. He was just chilling there. It was like he was frozen during our conversation. He may well have been. Oh, hi, friends. Galar is a huge island. Lighthouses have always been really important in helping ships find their way. Why does Nessa love the lighthouse so much? Um, because she loves water Pokemon. So she likes to be able to see the ocean. Hey, it's Toxtricity. This is a statue of a Pokemon that's said to have protected the lighthouse. Hi, Nessa. Nessa is... She's just Nessa. She's gorgeous. I love her. You must be a gym challenger, right? How did you know? You're one of the ones endorsed by Leon, right? You've become something of a hot topic among the gym leaders. Here you go, Miss Famous. I've already heard about you, so you should learn about me, too. Look at that belt. Just floating in pieces. Let's head to the stadium. I love fishing, but I love Pokemon battles even more. And I'm itching for a battle with you. All that belly showing. Oh, I don't remember this. I'm glad I just checked things by default. Default or default? The user attacks and captures opposing Pokemon using an electric net. This lowers their speed stat. I hope that's not all it does. I hope it does some damage, too. I don't think that you ever get to go inside the lighthouse, though, which is tragic, let me tell you. So I'm here. Docks. Netballs. A somewhat different Pokeball that is more effective when attempting to catch water or bug-type Pokemon. Things that you would catch in a net. That's smart, and it makes sense. Just the docks. Uh, I hope they understand that the ones that are completely enclosed are useless. Because, like, you can't get a boat in there without breaking the dock. Hey, ball guy! Hey there! Thanks for rolling by to have a chat with your mate, the ball guy! I see you have a fishing rod. In that case, I've got the perfect Pokeball for you. Is it a netball? The lure ball. Oh, that's right. He gives you special ones. A Pokeball that is good for catching Pokemon that you reel in with a rod while out fishing. If you manage to catch a Pokemon using your fishing rod, then it's time to use that lure ball. It's absolute best Pokeball for people who like Pokemon that live in the water. Pokeballs are just full of surprises, don't you think? I'm trying to do his dance with him and his speed is not consistent. Went to Dynamax. It might be a good idea to think ahead about which Pokemon is able to withstand Nessa's max moves. Nessa is strong and that's what's beautiful. Yeah, I bet. A challenger. Yeah, it's me. Why do we have to figure out a puzzle just to face the gym leader? Maybe it's to tell us trainers that we need to have some mental flexibility. Yeah. Challenge Alexiak. Beat Nessa, okay? Promise. Oh, I promise. Let's go. Shall we start the process to get you ready for the gym mission? Let's do it. That's right. You'll have to change into your uniform. Changing room is located over there. Okay, we've got like eight minutes, so we might not actually battle Nessa today. And we can't use our box link once we've started. No, wait. Wait, let me... Let me check my Pokemon before I start. No, I'm gonna use this team, that's fine. No, we, oh, this one, that's right. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, we're not going to battle Nessa today, but we are going to get through this gym mission, I think. 
a challenging maze, and you must reach the goal to clear the mission. However, some paths in the maze are blocked by water. What should you do then? Try pressing that red button over there, and I imagine you'll figure it out, future champ. Thanks, pal. Now, let the gym mission begin! Welcome to Holbury Stadium. Ready to bask in the beauty of watertight moves? That's one heck of a pose, Julia. You know what? I believe it. I don't know if you guys watch Drawfee, but I think Julia would make that kind of grimace while posing to look forward at something. Sound type moves. Aww, all the way down to the L. Tim Hall. What's wrong, Quinn? <laughs> Not by the hair of my Quinny Quinn chin. Yeah. 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 Nothing, Mommy. The cracker? Tim Hall fainted. I must have critted it. Or Slash must have been more effective, I guess. Oh, bye, Julia. Hey. Ah. Huh? Temple and I were the ones who got soaked. Mm, 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 mm. I got money. Mm. And all kinds of good stuff for winning. I right, friends. So we gotta boot this. Bing. We gotta boot this. Bing. We gotta boot this. Bing. Okay. Easy peasy. On to the next one. We got a lady. <sighs> we'll use Thumper so that not check summary. We'll use Thumper so that we can just breeze through this place. Come on. <clears throat> Let's go. Pressing a button stops the water, but you've got to think about the order too. Dana bana bum bo bona bum ba hi heather ba bum ba dana such out a crabby bum ba bona I bet he's he'll be crabby after he gets thumped by thumper. I gotta do a customary branch. Boop <laughs> So my plan is to within probably a couple of weeks, maybe a month, be Switched over to a capture card. That's my plan. Could be wrong. It could take longer than that, but that's the goal. And so I want to get my booking in. Book! While I have the chance. That's what you guys love about me, my silly antics. If I get really good at editing, I guess I could add it in. Gain experience points. Thumper grew to level 25. Woot woot. We're fish. No, we're, we're just going to breeze on through. I think I need electric when I get to Nessa, though. Because if I remember correctly, her final Pokemon is Lapras, which has the ice, which is going to be super effective against my grass or flying. So I need Drago to level up quite a bit, which is why I don't want to use him. Because I don't want him to... Yeah, we don't want him to faint. We don't want him to miss out on any of the good stuff. Uh, thank you. No levels there. Mm, thank you. When is... I wasn't sure about the right thing to do in that battle. You got $1,920 for winning. Okay, anyway. Quinn is feeding his snacks to me because he doesn't like to eat food. Okay. So this. And then this one. Boop. Okay. Good. See? See? So now... We need the blue one. Which means we need the red one. 
We need a yellow one, which I guess is going to be this one down here. Oh, shoot. Nope, gotta undo the red. Alright, okay. so we need the yellow first, then the red, then we can do the blue. We yellow. I knew that red was tricky. I knew it in my heart. Okay, I have time to battle this lady. Yeah, then we'll finish up, because she's the last one, so... Ah. Lynn. Yeah. You know, I say she, but the, the water gym trainers are pretty gender ambiguous, honestly. Brunch poke. Poke. Nice. They all have pretty feminine names, though, so. Okay. I'm gonna use a branch poke because I don't want this to take a uh, razor leaf. I mean, because if she heals up, I don't want. Yeah. It turned out to not be necessary, but I didn't want to have to do a whole other waste of ground. Okay, Drago got a level. With that strength, it's no wonder you beat me and my Pokemon. Okay. Oh, friends and fam. Hi! We're almost there. We've almost beat the gym mission. Gym challenge. Pop. Boom. All done. There we go. There we go. We beat the gym mission. Da da da. Bum bam. Gym mission clear. Dun, 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 dun. So, this is going to be the end of this episode. If you liked this episode, give it a like. Give the channel a subscribe. Drop a comment telling me what your favorite water type Pokemon is, specifically. Um, yeah. So that we know what we should be fighting against Nissa. Alright. Peace, friends and fam.